golden day is ours. Sacre bleu! I have been hit! Who's winning? Nobody's winning! Want to know who's losing? The Bonaparte family name! Look, I forfeit, okay? You win. Napoleon Bonaparte wins again. Is that the real Napoleon Bonaparte? I mean, the imaginary real Napoleon Bonaparte? Yeah, I'm actually related to him. Can you believe it? Shut up! Stop telling people that shameful fact. I don't even want to be here. But when this sad excuse for a Bonaparte lost a simple game of war to a feeble-minded invalid, I just could not take it anymore. I was forced to take control, and I will stay in control until I beat the love of victory into this degenerate swan who dares to call himself a Bonaparte. No, really, great-great-great-grandpa Napoleon, I do love victory, like, a ton. I love it so much... You can go now, I swear. Your move! Who? Who's winning now? What do you think? Who's winning now? <laughs> Sacre bleu! I wish my own descendants had your fighting instinct. Ow! Oh, go ahead. Beat me up. I don't care. Trust me, he doesn't. Hmm... What's this? My lazy opponent is actually trying to win? He has sent in reinforcements. Well, well. Then let the game truly begin. Send in my best soldier. You, destroy that bridge for France! For France? I hate your stupid bridge. This is how much I hate you. Ha <laughs> ha! Suck on that bridge! Ah, yes. Now I shall go torment this poor peasant over here. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, man, now look. The bridge is broken and I can't move my pieces past it anymore. I quit. Napoleon, you win. No, we don't forfeit. We're gonna beat you, Mr. Genetic Memory of Napoleon Bonaparte. Ha-ha! <laughs> I like your je ne sais quoi, your joie de vivre. Maybe you will teach my long-legged nincompoop a lesson, eh? <laughs> Alors... I wish my own descendants had your fighting instinct. Hey, don't touch my pieces! That is cheating! Excuse me, Mr. Bonaparte, but how do you play this game? Ah, this game is so easy, even a child like you can play it. All my worthless descendant has to do is move a knight piece into the center of my stronghold. Ha <laughs> ha! But his knight isn't even on the board. He's hiding out in that house. Well, maybe he's got a good reason. And knights are good at storming strongholds, but they are no good at field combat. So he'll also need a strong militia to fight my soldiers. But he has no militia! 
These people are hiding out in their houses. Hopeless, hungry, and unarmed. Yeah, but... And if they came out to form a strong militia, they wouldn't be able to move around the board because I keep breaking his bridges. Hey, that part is your fault. He could easily fix the bridges I keep breaking if he just had a carpenter. But his carpenter is hiding out in his house! <laughs> Afraid. Well, war is scary. So you see, it is an easy game, but Fred has already lost it. Not this time. This time, we're going to win. No, we're not. Fred, shut up. Word to the wise, give up while you can. Fred's gonna win. <laughs> I can burn wood with my mind. But well, that would be how you say, uh, cheating! Hey, don't touch my pieces! That is cheating! Hello? Sorry. I can't storm Napoleon's stronghold today. Too weak. Oh. Okay. Want me to call a doctor? No, I'm not sick. I just can't find any decent food around here. An army moves on its stomach, you know. An elite force such as I require an elite cuisine, I'm afraid. Oh, well, I'll keep on the lookout for some place with good takeout. Only the best, young lad. I am a Frenchman. And anything but the finest French delicacy might bruise my palate and leave me unable to storm anything, save the vomitorium. Ew. Hey, are you feeling any better? If we storm Napoleon's stronghold, we win the game, you know. Beat Napoleon and everything. Oh, that sounds like a grand plan, sir. But not on an empty stomach. I'm sure you understand.
the steam and trunk tag for this guy. I need the steamer trunk tag for this guy. Recruiting for the army of Fred Bonaparte and... Go away! Fred Bonaparte has forgotten the people, and we have forgotten him! What? Fred loves the people! He was just telling me that some of his best friends are... um... the people! He has abandoned us. He doesn't care if we live or die. Look, I'll tell you what. I'll talk to Fred. I'll talk to him, and I'll prove to you that he cares about the common man, and that the fight is not meaningless. I'll believe it when I hear it from him. Hey, we really need your help out here on the battlefield. Did you talk to Fred Bonaparte yet? Oh yeah, that's what I was supposed to do. The problem is, people think you don't care. What? I care? Then lead them to victory, Milky Toast! Shut up! They think you don't care if they live or die. What do they want from me? A notice on my official stationery that says I'd be sad if they died? Yep. Huh. Well, if that doesn't work... Let me guess. You give up? Bingo! Ha! Another game at which I would surely defeat you. Hey, you take that little victory if you need it, tiny man. Thanks for the note. You have really nice handwriting. Yeah, well, I was a calligraphy major in college, actually. Oh. Ugh, this just gets worse and worse the more I know. Look, Fred cares. You can't just tell the people you care about them. You have to show them by leading them nobly into war. Cares? Not as much as my leader does. Hip. Got it. Hip. 
Hello in there. Any carpenters home? Go away, burglar. I'm not a burglar. I'm a recruiter for Fred Bonaparte's army. We're a little light in our corps of engineers, see? Listen, I know you're a burglar. I've been listening to your footsteps on my roof all night trying to break in. Why don't you just slide down the chimney? I got a nice fire going for you in here, Mr. Burglar. Okay, if I'm a burglar, then how can I be down here talking to you and up on the roof at the same time? Maybe you're a ventriloquist. Listen, if I go see what's up on your roof and take care of it, will you come out and help fight Napoleon? Maybe. Good enough. Hey, how do I get up on your roof? Well, I think you ventriloquist burglars usually walk across those ropes that are tied to my neighbor's roof. You know, I should really take those down with all the burglars we have walking around. I needs a duffel bag tag. Okay, you can come out. Burglar's gone. Wow. You're pretty tough for a ventriloquist. Okay, here I come. Just show me where there's some wood to work on, and I'll go to town. bugging you? Yes. Well, why don't you come out here and fight him? Hmm. What's the pay? Uh, freedom? <laughs> Forget it. Thank you. 
cares? Well, then he should put his money where his mouth is and pay us. Look! Fred cares. I only care about wood and nails and bridges. How about you fix that broken bridge over there? How about you fly me over there? My legs seem to be glued onto this base, which is kind of weird. Look! Fred cares! Not enough to feed his troops anything but chip beef on toast. Oh! I can't believe I spoke the name of that dish! Yep. Can you give me a little hint here? <sighs> Move the carpenter over to the bridge so he can fix it. Oh, now who went and broke my beautiful bridge? Don't worry, darling. We'll get you fixed up good as new in no time. Man, I am good. Mm. Good work on that bridge there. Yeah, I think I nailed that one. <laughs> Carpenter joke. Oh man, I would totally love to move over there, but that soldier would kick my ass, and I'm not getting paid for that. So be it! If it is truly a time of war, then we are ready. We can no longer pull our heads into our shells and hide. We are, after all, armored warriors, and this is our land too. We may not be fast, but we always march upon the glittering path of righteousness, for we created ourselves from our hearts. Lead us onward, and let us eat holes in the leaves of Napoleon's garden. Wow. Right on. Yes.
I better not. I should only feed my own army. You guys ready? Yes! We're ready to fight for the Fatherland! To fight nobly on the field of battle! Our shells are tough, and soon we will cover the enemy with our silvery trails! Okay. Just remember there are many different ways to serve your Fatherland. Hey, I have an important message from your fearless leader. Oh my god, he does care, he does! I knew it! Fred Bonaparte is the greatest leader of all time! I can't wait to die for his cause! Well, you might not die. You might win! Hey, he's a great leader, but he's still Fred. Okay. Hurl my innocent bones into the cruel machine of war. I'm ready. Time to fight for the fatherland. Okay, I'm ready. Now put me right next to Napoleon's lackey and you'll see some action. Whose side are you on? Hey, knock it off! Ah! Ah! Take that! Die! Die! I kill you! Sacre bleu! I cannot believe it, Fred! You have accidentally done something right! I have? Yes, but I'm afraid it's still not enough. More manpower! Ah, oh, mon dieu! I hate bridges! Ah! That is for killing my father! Bridge! Hey, stop killing my bridges! You're making me mad! How about you fix that broken bridge over there? How about you fly me over there? <gasps> hey, can you give me a little hint here? <sighs> You've got another broken bridge. Get your carpenter. Oh, now who went and broke my beautiful bridge? Don't worry, darling. We'll get you fixed up good as new in no time. Man, I am good. Mm. So, now that the guy is gone, I'm recruiting for Fred Bonaparte's army, and Fred really cares. What's the pay? What? Well, this works hazardous. I want hazard pay. Well, I could talk to Fred. Not for me, you understand. I have to take care of my family once I'm killed. What's all this talk of death? We're going to win. Yeah, right. You just come back when you get Fred to pay up. Hello? I'm recruiting... Go away! I'm not coming out till the soldier's gone. I'm unarmed. Um... He left. He said he had to go to the bathroom and, and he left. Now, yeah, nice try.
I can arm our troops with that. Ha! if we had some pawn shops in this town, and I could sell it! Cool musket, eh? Excellent! Now, take that gun and go shoot me a fine game pheasant. Then bring it to my favorite chef in Paris. It's not loaded. Oh, I'm going to faint. some armaments for the troop. Ah, oh, get that gun out of my face. Why don't you go arm the people who are doing the fighting? Cool musket, eh? Fred's troops wouldn't know what to do with one of those. Can't get a good grip. Hey, you found my super valuable rare coin. Yeah. Can I have it? Knock yourself out. I got enough memories of my dumb ancestors hanging around. Urgh. Hey, I found this rare coin in the fire. Oh, that's where it was. Well, you can have it. Last thing I want is another family heirloom. Hey, check out this coin I found. Ah, a priceless Bonaparte family heirloom. You can have that. It's worthless to me. Ugh! Hey, check out this coin I found. Hey, do not try to bribe my troops. They are too loyal anyway, and would never leave me. Oui, 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 but uh, call me two weeks. If we don't get more funding, I'm going to jump ship. Hey, check out this coin I found. Man, I could buy a gun with that if there were a decent pawn shop in town. Hello? I'm recruiting... Go away! I'm not coming out till the soldier's gone. I'm unarmed. Hey, check out this coin I found. Oh, how I wish there were a gourmet restaurant in town so that I might take that coin and buy myself a fine meal.
I'm recruiting for Fred Bonaparte's army, and Fred really cares. What's the pay? Hey, check out this coin I found. Money! Oh, man! Well, I'm off to die in battle, dear, for an incompetent leader who'll never know my name. I hope you remarry well. More of that negative talk. I just hope she doesn't spend it all on scrapbook making supplies. She's gone nuts about that stuff. Part of the reason I'm so ready to die. Anyway, let's go. War ahoy and all that stuff. I kill you! Haha! <laughs> Not bad, Fred! What? What I do? You're doing better than usual. And I hate to end the fun, but I guess it's time to put an end to this, as usual. Guard the bridge to the stronghold with your life! None shall pass! I haven't had escargot like that since the Duchess's birthday, but even those were not so full of spirit. I am truly inspired. Come, let us storm Napoleon's stronghold and win this game for Fred Bonaparte. But do hurry. I believe I may be hungry again soon. All right, let's take Napoleon's stronghold and win the game. Game? War! Woo! Yes, the stronghold's wall is thick, but I shall crack it open like a shell. And I will rip that shell off and... and saute it in butter and eat it and gorge to my heart's delight. Concentrate. War time. Right. Well, just move me over there and take that snail. Stronghold. Stronghold. Please, do not distract me, for now my only thought is of storming that stronghold. soldiers for the army of the caring and generous Fred Bonaparte. Weapon. What? Weapon. That's what I want. I'm not gonna die like the others, okay? That's the spirit. You get me my special musket and I'll come out. I think I left it buried in some hay in that heavily guarded building over there. Then I'll sign up and kill me some Napoleon lovers, got it? Be right back. Okay, there's your special musket. Ready? All right, now I'm all set to go rob that stupid carpenter. What? I got you that gun so you could fight Napoleon's army, not the carpenter. I've been trying to break into his house for days now, but he's always got a fire going, so I can't get down his chimney. Well, could you just fight this one lousy soldier first? He's kind of in the way anyway. Okay, but just as practice. Where is he? Why aren't you using that gun I gave you? I'm too far away. You gotta move me closer to that soldier. Careful, I have a gun. Cool musket, huh? Oh, wait. Have to reload here. Die. Die. I kill you. But I... How? 
Retreat! Everyone into the stronghold! Rest the drawbridge! Immediately! Jam the mechanism with something! Anything! Hey! You can't jam the gears! That's cheating! All is fair in love and war! You have fought well! But that is far as you shall go, my friend! Ha! We'll see about that! Fred? Was that you? Yeah! Come on! We're winning! All we have to do is unjam those gears! I'm on it, General! Was easy. Stronghold stormed. Game one. Oh, you have to storm the stronghold with your knight, you stupid fool. Oh. Who? Hey, can you give me a little hint here? <sighs> ha! No help from me. You have fought well, but you will never get that drawbridge down, so your knight will never be able to storm my stronghold. Your walls are no thicker than the crust of a creme brulee. Behold the mighty tapping of my spoon. What? What is this? Fred! Did you do this? Huh? Uh, what? I can't believe it! You! You are a Bonaparte! There is some Napoleon in your veins after all! Well, m maybe. Finally! I can resign myself back into my glorious history. The future is yours, Fred Bonaparte. You are indeed a true warrior. Go forth and fight all your battles with the same determination you showed here, and your life will be an endless parade of victories, like mine. Yes, well, except for that last one. The one in Waterloo? Mm, I was sick that day. Very bad stomach cramp, let me tell you. That's why I've always got my hand tucked in here, you know? <laughs> You'll find out when you're older. It's uh, hereditary. Is he really gone? Hello? Hello? Anyone else in here? Ha! We did it, Raz! I'm all me again. One person. Not French. Get me out of this dang jacket so I can go strangle me an orderly. Hey, good thinking, Fred. That sure would save me a lot of work. Yep! Right after I take a nap. Yes! Uh, what? Nap? <sighs> War is hell, Rasputin. And I am sleepy. Uh, I'll take care of Crispin for you. Just as soon as I... I, uh... Oh, man.
one no. 